special sauce. Like, it's the best sauce you'll ever have. It's nice, creamy, <laughs> salty, and cheesy. Like, nobody does not. Like, who doesn't want that? Now, some of you may be thinking that this sauce sounds a little weird. Well, for all you who say that, you're dumb. Because this sauce <laughs> is the one of a kind special sauce that you've never <laughs> seen any other restaurant do. Because you see, no other restaurant can make special sauce like Freddy Fazbear. Now, the only way to create this sauce <laughs> is if Freddy himself inks his turkey onto the batter and onto anything he wants. Because you see, that's the only way for you to get the sauce. You have to yank his turkey. Now, once you finish yanking his turkey, you might see some some yellow, no, some white, some white stuff come out. Now, that right there is the sauce. All you have to do is mix it with some cheese, and then that's God's hair. You see, that right there is why Freddy Fazbear is the best place to eat from. Because once you eat from there, you'll never feel the same. Like, you can come there straight, and I don't know what. Next thing you know what, you're a whole circle at that point. Like, you're, you're, you just feel it. Like, you just want to be with Freddy Fazbear. That's why Freddy Fazbear Pizzeria is the best rated place. Because everyone loves how they feel after they eat the pizza. It just... It gives you this this tingling feeling like every time people look at Freddy, they be wondering like, man, I should should get the sauce right from the source. Like maybe I should like do a little something. Like they like Freddy be risen everybody up, bro. Like you like you know he risen everybody up. That special sauce, like everyone loves that. Like you gotta yank the turkey, you gotta suck the turkey, <laughs> you gotta do everything with the turkey to get the special sauce. That is my friend. Is how you get the sauce. Now. You're probably wondering if you can make the sauce yourself. Well, the answer to that is no. The only way you could probably make the sauce together with Freddy is if you know you little throw a little something in the in the little bedroom, you know, throw it back in there, Got to show some, throw some nice ass to Freddy. He might he might think of you. But if that's not the case, then Freddy not gonna look at you. You might think that, you know, you don't swing that way, you're not that person. Well, once you see Freddy's special sauce, it's going to be a different point of view. You're going to sit there and change your mindset and tell yourself that you're that person, that you're home, that you're going to be the one who's going to decide to take that sauce to heart. Now, that sauce, Freddy loves it. He tells everyone that how much of a good sauce it is. Now, you know, there might be a little people who, like, think that it's not, like, Bonnie from time to time says that, Bro, you're kind of disgusting for doing that, bro. Like, I'm trying to eat some regular pizza, and you're sitting here just beating your meat all over the pizza. I can't even eat it right. Like, I don't even look at you the same, or I don't even look at pizza the same. Ever since you just beat your meat, sitting there choking your turkey just for some freaking sauce. Like, I'm trying to have some regular sauce on this pizza, but I can never have that sauce. Because you're sitting here yanking your turkey just to get this sauce out. Well, you know, Freddy don't like it when people just deny his sauce. So, <laughs> he bends them over. Oh, he God. has their asses face up. And then, he pulls out his turkey and then starts clapping. Now, probably thinking that that's wrong. But you see, Freddy, he understands that if you do it to someone... They'll end up agreeing with you because you see they know how good and how it will feel because you see once you feel something good and once you taste something good you'll never go back so he has to do it now you may think that freddy will like offer this stuff to like every